guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all good. Today I'm gonna actually be taking you through my top Kmart products for home organization. As you guys know, Kmart is probably one of my favorite places to buy pretty much anything. Let's be honest, you go to Kmart to buy one thing and come out with like 50 and you have like a new scooter, new slippers, a new vase and anything. Anyway. So yes, yeah, so I'm going to take you through my top picks and how I use these products to organize my home and I hope this helps. Um, it is a really good time right now to be like organizing and decluttering your home. So please, if you have any video suggestions you'd like me to do to help you do this, leave them below. Let's start in the pantry. So Kmart have a lot of um, products that I love to organize my pantry. So this was, this is a wide rollout tub from Kmart and I use this for our bread. Um, we do have quite a lot of bread in this house. We have like pizza bases, crumpets, burgers, stuff like that. So that's why I like to use this big one. I also have this for our back stock. So basically any foods that we run out, we know to look down here. So it could be pasta, milk, anything like that. Um, so that's one of the products. Another one I love is these long and narrow tubs. So these are perfect for small pantries. When you have a small and narrow pantry, you need to make sure you think small and narrow tubs. This is gonna allow you to get all the storage at the back and you basically just slide it out. So those are perfect for small pantries. Another Kmart favorite is the Lazy Susans. These are amazing for in your fridge, which I'll show you a bit later, and then also your spreads and vinegars. Yes, we are one of those families that we like to keep our Vegemite in the pantry, okay? Another favorite from Kmart is these, is these fold out shelves. So these just like the legs fold out and it's a clear plastic shelf. Um, that's gonna give you more levels. And this is good for so many things. Like I've used it over here as well in my cupboard. This is like our smoothie and proteins cupboard. So I got this wire one. So really think about utilizing all the space you have by putting in more levels and stuff like that. So yeah, definitely love the double shelves. Another Kmart favorite is these wine holders. As you can see, I use these for our shakers, our smoothie makers. I also use it for our kids' drink bottles up here. As you can see, we have a lot. Um, yeah, it just keeps, just keeps it nice and organized. You can also use the Kmart wine rack, which works perfectly as well. These are the Kmart fridge baskets. I use these like literally everywhere. They're in the medicine cupboard. We use them for lunch boxes, Willow's bottles, which are all stained from pasta sauce. But yeah, it just keeps everything super neat and tidy. Also, I will be linking all these products below so you know what's what. Um, I don't know how much is gonna be in stock at the moment with being everyone being in isolation. I think everyone's kind of buying from Kmart more than normal, um, but I will link them below for Aussies. My next favorite thing is this. So this is a flip lid container. So I use this for all our packaged snacks and it locks into place as well. So you can literally just throw all your packets in there. I also use this. I also use that for our shopping bags, which I'll show you. Um, we store all of our reusable shopping bags in these. This is in our butler's pantry. This is under the sink. So we use two of these for shopping bags. So it's just easy to be able to shove them all in one place. So that's another favorite. You can use them for so many things. Kids toys, washing. There's like so many things you can use them for. Even like kids' shoes, that'd be a really good way to store their shoes as well. Moving out of the pantry and in it to the kitchen. Um, one of one of the questions I probably get asked every single day is how to store Tupperware containers. I know it can be pretty tricky, so I'm going to show you guys how I do it. So here is our Tupperware drawer. As you can see, I have everything in a certain order. So these are literally $3. These are the file holders. So I just got white so it blends in with the drawer. And I basically just file all the Tupperware lids together vertically. And then I stack all the bottoms together. So you're never going to lose what you're looking for. Um, this is just going to really help utilize your space. You can also obviously do this in a cupboard as well. So that's probably one of my favorite kitchen storage hacks is using file holders for your lids. Now I'm going to take you guys into my fridge. Now with this, oh, these are my Steph Pace Planner fridge magnets. I'll give you that guys the link. I released these not long ago and they are so good. I'll quickly show you. So you've got like your meal planner. You've got your monthly overview and then also your don't forget list. So I'll give you, I've got a special discount code just for my YouTube fam, which I'll put below. But yeah, these are my own products and I made them because I just felt like 
there was a gap in the market that I needed to fill and they make me so organized. They're so pretty. Anyway, moving on, get into the fridge. <laughs> so this is my fridge. This is literally one of the best things I've ever bought from Kmart. So this is the Clear Lazy Susan. Um, so we use this for sauces and our butter and stuff. So it stops everything from being like knocked over. And then this is again is like the long and narrow tray which we use for kids yogurt. Down here we have the pull out um, tubs which we use for lunches and the kids snacks. And then if you can see here, these smaller ones we use for dairy and meats. So that's like meats for the week and then that's any dairy stuff. Just having a few like tubs and the Lazy Susan from Kmart makes our fridge super organized. I'll do like a full fridge tour because there's a lot more to our fridge than what it looks like um, on how to organize your fridge. So yes, Lazy Susan and these narrow tubs are the best. So now I'm going to move on to kids craft storage and like drawing books and all that stuff. I know this stuff can be super hard to keep organized. Um, there's a lot of bits and pieces and it can get really messy. So these are just a few ways I organize our kids craft stuff. So these big tubs obviously aren't Kmart, but these magazine holders, uh, I love them. So I actually use these for our warranties and our manuals as well. Um, I just got the little label co labels on i think this is font nine i'm pretty sure so in here we have drawing books activity books and then puzzles and then inside puzzles is probably also one of my other favorite kmart hacks ever so this is the kmart carry case and you literally can fit all your kids a4 puzzles in there and it's going to stop all your pieces from getting lost because there's nothing worse than having like a million different puzzle pieces sitting around. These are only $3 each and they're in the stationery section. They're literally called carry case. Um, but yeah, these have been a game changer for us. Kids puzzles are the bane of my existence. <laughs> I hate having to put them back together and then you lose pieces. So yeah, these are amazing. So in here is our party drawer. So obviously being a parent, we get lots of kids parties happening. Um, so these are, these are like the long rollout containers that can be divided so we've got the, I've taken the dividers out as you can see and I've just like made them as big as I want so I've got three here and I've just put them into sections so I've got like balloon holders string cutlery napkins and then like shot glasses and stuff like that so that just keeps everything in its like own little section also love these for organizing cleaning so like cleaning cloths and like vacuum pieces and stuff just keeps everything nice and organized this next area i'm going to show you is one spot in the house a lot of people struggle like to know what to do with so it's under the sink so obviously we've got two under the sinks but this is the one in the main kitchen okay so here we have under the sink it's really sad that I'm doing a video about under my sink, but anyway. So these are actually the old Kmart wooden drawers. They don't have these anymore, but they now have one that's about the size of two of these together, which I think is actually better. Um, so I'll link you to the new one because obviously these aren't in stock anymore. But yeah, so these are literally wooden drawers of labeled. So we've got dishwashing tablets in here. And then we've got dish cloths in here and then the sponges. Um, this is just like an old tray I had. I don't even know where it's from. And then up here, we obviously have the removable hooks. Um, these are amazing. They will like allow you to use door space up so you don't have all this stuff in the, in the cupboard. So I use this for like bottle brushes and cleaning cloths. You can also use this for your gloves as well. But yeah, this is just like a really easy way to keep under your sink nice and organized. And it actually stays like this, which is awesome. You can also get pressure rods and pop it along the top to hang like cloths and like your cleaning solutions and stuff too, which I've seen some people do, which looks awesome. So yeah, that's that one. Here we have the kids downstairs toy storage. So this is in our downstairs lounge room. Um, I wanted it to fit in with like the coastal theme of the house. So that's why I went for these whitewash baskets and these are actually from Target. But this shelf is from Kmart and it's actually a vertical shelf and I just literally flipped it on its side and turned it into a toy storage shelf. Basically with these, obviously when your kids are little and they can't read, you can laminate pictures of what goes in each basket and pop them on, on the front. Um, I just put labels on because it's me. Anyway, uh, yeah, so that's another little Kmart hack that I did. It's not really a hack, but anyway, just used a Kmart shelf for its purpose. Um, 
But yeah, it's just a good way to store your toys for the kids. All of my labels are from Little Label Co. I'll give you guys my discount code below and you can get 15% off their labels. It's literally where I get all these acrylic tags. All the labels you see in my house are from Little Label Co. But yeah, I just basically have the toys into different categories. Um, so like games, books, dolls, miscellaneous, baby toys, and play sets. And then I just have this like big laundry hamper that's not from Kmart. Um, but yeah, Kmart obviously have baskets too. So it just depends what you want. I wanted the whitewash, so that's why I went for Target. So I'm going to quickly show you inside the office. So... I'll show you like how we keep the manuals and warranties like I mentioned before. All right, so here we have these little plastic drawers. This is in the stationary um, part of Kmart. So I use this for birthday cards. I like to buy them in bulk and then I just quickly grab one when we need it. And I also have these for the girls. So these are where I keep some of their like special notes from school or just anything that they made that was really cute. Um, so I pop them in here. So that is that one. You can also obviously use these for invoices, bills and stuff on your desk. But yeah, I really like these. For, I really like to make sure I have a lot of like party stuff on hand because I hate being caught out. <laughs> and again, here are the magazine holders. These are the gray ones and that's what I use to put manuals and warranties in. So I love these. Now I'll take you guys upstairs to the bathroom and I'll just show you how I store some cotton pads and like cotton buds and stuff. So these were super cheap as well. Obviously it's Kmart. Let's find it. So here's our bathroom and now these are the little glass canisters from Kmart. So you can use these to store like cotton pads and cotton buds. Um, this one is actually from Freedom. But yeah, I wouldn't say they're 100% airtight though for your pantry. But they do a, a nice job for like bathroom and storage. Anyways guys, that's pretty much all of the Kmart well, some of the Kmart things that I really enjoy and love. Um, I could probably be here all day and go through them, but they're definitely my top ones. If you guys enjoyed this video, please comment below any other decluttering organization videos. I could definitely do an Ikea version of this one because um, I love Ikea. And yes, anyways, thanks for watching and I will see you guys next week. Bye.